so the videos you just saw are from yesterday which was technically supposed to be my first full day in munich however i just went to the marion plots for like two or three hours before i started to not feel very good so i came back to my hotel room and i rested and today i'm feeling much better so we're calling today my first full day in munich I'm heading back to Marion Platz because there were some food places that I was interested in trying out. And it's around lunchtime, or about to be lunchtime, so we're gonna go there first. And then there are some things that I found on the internet that looked really awesome that I want to see. So we're gonna go do that after food. <music> lunch at this really cute place. It was Bravian Cuisine. So I had sausage, potato, sauerkraut. I feel like I'm authentic as you can get in the tourist area for Bravian Cuisine. And now I'm heading to do some tourist things. is the church the cathedral of munich or munich's cathedral although it's known by locals as frankirchi i'm pretty sure i'm pronouncing it wrong so i'll put it on the bottom it's pretty much a symbol of the Bravian city of munich and the place where the archbishop usually stays so it's really beautiful inside Cathedral, which is a more well known cathedral, and it is gorgeous inside. Even if you're not religious, I feel like going into these churches and slash cathedrals is a must because the architecture, the art, and the history in them is amazing. So, I just went to the store to buy water because I think I got super sick yesterday because of dehydration and eating very unhealthily. So I'm trying to eat better and then drink lots more water. So I bought two bottles, but I already drank one. And I drank one outside the store, like I sat down in this little picnic eating area. And while I was sitting down, a couple people approached me and were trying to talk to me, I believe in German. But once I said that I spoke English, they all like switched to English. And there was a couple people that just wanted to like converse with me like where I was from. I'm guessing they just want someone to talk to. One lady even like showed me pictures of her son who's in school and is learning how to talk. But it's just fun to talk to people from different places. I knew one was trying to practice their English because she was asking me a bunch of terms and translations like what things mean. But it was fun. And now I'm on my way to another church. It looks like it's going to be a church kind of day. So the next church that I just went to is called the Atene Church. However, currently it's not open so I can't walk inside. It's nice from the outside. And then secondly, they're building like a concert venue right outside the church. I don't know what's gonna be there, but they have lights, cameras, sound systems and whatever. So I didn't want to tackle that. And so I walked about a hundred feet and now I'm sitting near a garden. Just resting for a little bit, charging my phone because it's about to die. And then I'm gonna go hit my last church of the day. 
which is called a song church, I believe. Yep, it's a church kind of day. Get all the churches out in one day. The architecture and the art and the history within the churches is super cool. <laughs> unlike any church that I've ever been in. And it's actually in between like shopping centers now because it used to be a private chapel that doesn't have like a certain religious oversight, but it's awesome inside. And it's actually really small inside as well. There's only like eight tiny pews, but the architecture and the art so I'm back at my hotel after seeing a song in church and I just rested for a little bit and now I'm heading back out because tomorrow I have a day trip to a castle and I'm bringing my own food because they're not feeding us on the tour so I'm going out to buy some picnic food. I think today was a pretty amazing day considering yesterday i did not feel good at all and even though i just saw a bunch of churches today it was great i got to see a lot of munich and i just love the architecture and history which i feel like i'm seeing a lot while traveling through cities in europe but it's been awesome and i can't wait to go to the castle tomorrow it's my first time venturing outside a big city while i'm here but this is a bucket list item for me I'm so excited.